Okay, so um, just wanted to do a quick um, demo of uh, something to look out for in Jupyter Notebook. So one of the things about Jupyter Notebook is great because you can do um, code and commenting, uh, you know, like an actual notebook journal, um, you know, like a learning journal. So it's really useful for that. Um, you can also run your code in um, in sections, so you can you can write some code and then do some comments and then write some more code and the code that you wrote earlier relates to each other now the thing is is if you then bring all that code together um, and you want to kind of say for example using it for um, competitive programming type uh, type training like I'm doing um, that can be a problem so if I, I'll, I'll give you an example. So if I do uh, something like this, um, okay, great, happy days. So, and then if I say print word as you'd normally do, yeah, great, that's fabulous. But if I then, I can, I can then actually use that further down. And it will still do the same thing and also if I then delete um, if I delete the, 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 uh, the cell there um, it'll also still remember it now the thing is is that if I then save that and come out of this so if I shut that down um, and then to go find it again now go back into there if I then try and run this again it won't work because it needs to run the code in segments again um, you know in a logical way so when you post into competitive programming sites before you actually snip the code out of here um, my recommendation is is close and halt the notebook and then reopen it again and test that the, uh, pro the program still works as you expect it to. Um, so um, there you go. That's my uh, that's my little tip of something to look out for in Jupyter Notebook and be careful of because it can really uh, can really cause you some issues.